Our officers are used to spending time in the hospitals. They're aware of it's it's a necessary part of their duties, um, but. Our officers are human beings too, and nobody likes to wait. Police are spending thousands of hours annually at city hospitals, but only a small fraction of that is spent responding to emergencies. WPS leadership say the long hours at the sites is causing challenges for both frontline officers and police resources. Our officers are, are always wanting to get back out on the streets and handle the calls for service. WPS officers have spent the equivalent of more than 1,900 days in on-duty hours at city hospitals between 2012 and 2021. Deputy Chief of Operations Scott Halley says duties inside range widely from monitoring an in-custody patient to assisting with sexual assault investigation protocol. The Manitoba Nurses Union says high tension and frustration from patients and their families is creating unsafe environments for nurses and frontline staff, forcing them to call police for help. Reflecting on his time as a patrol officer, Haley knows personally the impact time serving in hospital can have. I know how our frontline members are feeling about it, and anything that I can do, our service can do, our partners can do to work together to help reduce the amount of time our officers are in the waiting rooms uh, in the ERs. Uh, I mean, I would appreciate it, but I know our frontline members would as well. The government of Manitoba committed to introducing institutional safety officers at hospitals in 2019, but since then, no such officers have been trained. Shared Health pointed to COVID-19 for the delay. The ISOs may be a great solution for us in the hospitals to help reduce the amount of time that our officers remain with patients at the hospital. Uh, we understand that the, the program was delayed as a result of the pandemic, but I mean, we're starting to gain traction again as we're seeing post-pandemic uh, progress in that initiative. Corey Wiles, president of the Winnipeg Police Association, agreed that the time spent at hospitals is a drain on WPS resources, but their officers will serve where needed. Quote, we are currently at a time of high demand for police services in addition to a higher volume of violent calls, so any drain on resources is concerning. That said, our members are in ERs because of their job function. The time that they spend in ERs is important and they will continue to carry out their responsibilities there and anywhere else they are called to. Halley says the relationship between police and shared health is important to keep hospitals safe and functioning properly. We can't work in vacuums. We need to work together collaboratively to find solutions. In Winnipeg, Morgan Majeski, City News.